cold peas that's ah, son of a bitch. All right, hey everybody. Uh, I've come back on here and I'm going to make some pea salad. I got four cans of peas right here that I put in the uh, refrigerator and so they're good and cold and ready to go. Uh, you can basically is to use um, shit. All right, y'all, I have my peas in here. Hello, everyone, and welcome to PB's Country Time. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, I am going to make some pea salad. Uh, I've got some recommendations of how to make this from, uh, well, the first main one's my granny because she's the one that figured out, uh, ah, shit. So I got four cans of cold peas in this, a little bit of mayonnaise, as you can see, I opened that, and that's how much I used, about a half almost, and also I had one jar of pimentos in this, and I also put uh, the three parts of a big yellow egg and a big yellow onion, eggs. and I mixed them together, which of course a processor or something would be a lot better to get your onions and your eggs and good state to mix this in but I don't think it looks pretty daggone good to be honest all right I got some salt uh, pepper and then I'm gonna put some salt just a little bit a little bit of I said pepper, Carolina. <laughs> I love your get up <laughs> for the rain. <laughs> I think it's gonna be good though. I could put a I could put another thing of pimentos in it, but I don't put too much salt in it. I do have low Chef. sodium low Chef. sodium peas in it so Chef well still so salt in it so I wouldn't put as much yeah, salt I didn't put that much. Chef CD will have to be the tester of it. Uh, this is, well, <laughs> Chef CD got <laughs> Chef PB into wanting to cook in it, to uh, cook in the uh, kitchen. <laughs> I was going to say Casey. <laughs> Anyways, shit. You're not done? I'm hungry. <laughs> well, you want some of it for real? Yeah, I told you I was going to test it. Oh. Well, I think I pretty much got everything in it. I could add more pimentos in it if I wanted. Uh, but I can't get the mug open for one thing. Yeah. yeah. It's tight. That's what she said. <laughs> I mean, it is really tight. I can't even jar it. Watch it. Watch that knife. Shoot. There he goes. Well, she got it, so I'm going to drain this, and I'm going to put just a little bit in here. I'll be all right, babe. All right, so I'm going to just put a little bit in here, because I've already put a whole jar, so I don't want to, you know, overpower it. But I'm pretty sure that gives off a lot of the color, too. So, all right, and you know you can put this in, this bad boy in overnight, and, oh, it would be great the next day. So... If you want to uh, know how to make this, I'll put the recipe in the description. Uh, also, would like to thank uh, Case, Andrea, Carla, Mary, Norma Lynn for letting me know how y'all make it. Uh, and I will tune in next time with y'all. Oh, you gotta let them see if it's good. Oh, or not. <laughs> I, was, I knew I was waiting on something. Okay. It's Trisha's bad boy. We gotta get some ingredients now. We can't just get peas. Get a little bit of egg. Mmm. That's good. Is it? Mm-hmm. Needs a little bit more pepper. A little bit more pepper. Mm -hmm. And see, you was making fun of me uh, when I was putting the pepper in. I'm not big on peas either, so that's, that's a dang. Yeah. Well, there's some of them biscuits I made. 
Uh, I told Granny she could heat them up in the oven with some butter on them and they'd turn out, you know. Is there any biscuits left? Yeah, I guess they're, they were on your cake. <laughs> hey, wait a <laughs> minute. Yeah, I ate two of them. <laughs> Did you put them in the oven though? Uh uh. I cooked me some bacon oh, and ate it with it. No, it should have. you should have put them in the oven for like 10 minutes with some butter on them. Oh, man. Mm -hmm. Like I said, I don't think there's any biscuits left. Oh, there's two left. Yeah. <laughs> well, anyways, I'll put that video. You can see how they turned out in the description also. Well, thanks for tuning in, and also, uh, y'all have a great day.